Cats are agile animals that can run, jump, and scratch with ease. All cats have the same general physical features, four legs, two ears, a tail, and a stout body, that help them maintain their agility and sprightliness. However, not all cats are created equal when it comes to thumbs. Do cats even have thumbs? It's up for debate as far as most cat enthusiasts are concerned. It's important to discuss the makeup of a cat's fingers and to learn about polydactyl cats, which have extra fingers on their paws, to understand why the topic is debatable. Here's what you should know. Cats are thought to have thumbs, but cats have five fingers on each of their paws, so one must be a thumb, right? The answer is not a simple one. Some people consider the fifth finger to be a thumb, but cats don't have thumbs the same way that we do. All five of their fingers work in the same way, so no one finger is opposable like a thumb on a human's hand would be. Cats don't need opposable thumbs to function and thrive, which is why they don't have them. Therefore, none of the fingers are thumbs like ours. Some people refer to the fifth finger on a cat's paw as a thumb, but it is just the same as the rest of the fingers, so other people are against referring to any of them as thumbs. Do polydactyl cats have thumbs? Polydactyl cats have extra fingers on their paws that often look just like the thumbs that we see on our own hands. However, those extra fingers are not opposable, even though they are typically referred to as thumbs by pet owners and veterinarians alike. Calling these extra limbs thumbs simply makes it easy to distinguish them from the basic five fingers that almost all cats are born with. Polydactyl cats usually have extra fingers or toes on their front paws, but some do grow extra ones on their back paws. There is no one specific kind of cat that might end up with extra fingers on their paws, but there are whole breeds, such as the American Polydactyl and Maine Coon Polydactyl, that are known for their extra appendages. The extra fingers are thought to be hereditary and do not pose any serious dangers to worry about unless they grow awkwardly and inhibit proper walking and movement. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. The Benefits of Extra Cat Toes or Fingers Although the extra limbs on a cat's paws may look like thumbs, they don't function in the same way that we would expect a thumb to. However, there are benefits for a cat having extra toes. First, the extra limbs can help them climb faster and more easily. Some cats can use their thumbs to pick up objects like toy balls. Those extra limbs can also help a cat fight off a predator or stray cat when spending time outside. Extra Considerations while there are no serious health conditions connected to having extra fingers or toes, many polydactyl cats have a condition called radial hypoplasia. Cats with this condition are sometimes referred to as squitten cats. Radial hypoplasia is a condition in which the cat's radius bone is only partially formed and is shorter than it should be. This makes it difficult for a cat to walk properly and can lead to its inability to balance. Many cats with this condition tend to hop around in order to avoid having to walk. Special veterinarian care can help correct the condition for a better quality of life. It is also important to know that some extra fingers or toes do not fully develop. This can lead to problems like ingrown nails and injuries. An undeveloped toe can get snagged on items, clothing, and blankets, which causes pain. It is crucial to inspect all of a cat's fingers or toes regularly to ensure that no damage has been done. Cats do not technically have thumbs, but any extra fingers on their paws are usually referred to as thumbs because that's what they look like. Any cat that has extra fingers or toes on their paws is called a polydactyl cat. You shouldn't expect your polydactyl cat to pick up a cup or anything, but they can climb, scratch, and play with toys more easily. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.